What's going on, you homies, Tonys, Conies, and Bronies? Now, today's video is going to be about those little hacker boys. Now, if you're an online gamer in any way, you know exactly who I'm talking about. I don't even know what to call these people because anytime you try to call them something, they always like to think they're something else. So if you're like, hey, dude, uh, you fucking queer hacker, they're like, dude, I'm a fucking booter, you fucking dumbass, you fucking stupid dude. We're anonymous, all right? We're legion. We never forgive, we never forget, we've never had sex. Now these poor little kids do tend to hang around in the Black Ops 2 era of Call of Duty because they are too broke to move on. Now everyone has had at least one encounter with this type of person. You know, you're in a lobby, you know, that you just joined and you're talking with your friend about how you think Christian Bale's the better Batman and he says some dumb shit like Adam West was and then some fucking kid out of nowhere just goes, Dude, I'm gonna fucking boot you! And you're like, whoa, 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 dude, you need to calm down. I haven't done anything to you. And then they take that as a threat, and then they're like, dude, you're gonna fucking, you're gonna be online after fucking World War III takes place, you fucking faggot. There's gonna be a cure for cancer before you're back online, you queer. And you're like, whoa, let's just take it easy, dude. That's a very long time. Let's not go blowing proportions here, all right? And they always try to scare you with the, uh, you know, talking about what they have. They're like, dude, I got a fucking 80k, 1080p, Ben Affleck, pop, shove it to the power, three fucking botnet queer. I got an RGH that's signed by Derek Rose, Russell Wilson, and the drummer from Green Day. What do you have? Uh, a fucking life. So I made a little scenario on what happens in a hacker's life, and I'm going to share it with you guys. So the hacker wakes up, let's just call him Bobby in this situation, so Bobby wakes up and he gets ready to go to school, and on his way to school he realizes, oh shit, he forgot to do his homework, his teacher's gonna be fucking pissed. So right off the bat, Bobby's not having a good day, so you know, he continues his time through school, it's about third period, and then he sees it. 400 pounds of pure bully. Now this bully fucking hates Bobby, you know, he looks a little something like this. Yep, that's the bully. Let's call him Chase. Chase doesn't like Bobby. There's Chase. Chase then sees Bobby, goes over to him, rips his hoodie right off his back, snaps his binder in half, does his homework, and spits in his fucking mouth. Bobby being a half-retarded hacker and all, all he can say is, I'm gonna fry your fucking router! So then Chase, now not knowing what the fuck that means, decides to Batista bomb Bobby and steal his left shoe. And you're probably like, well, why did he take his left shoe? You'll find out. So now you guys are probably thinking, wow, Bobby's having a pretty bad day. Well, it gets fucking worse. So on his way home after having a terrible day at school, his dad, who wasn't there when he woke up, finally decides to come home and he is looking at Bobby coming up the driveway and notices he does not have his left shoe. Bobby's dad then shoulder checks Bobby, knocks him down, picks him up by his ankle, picks him up over his head and continues to kick him in his fucking face. So now Bobby is pretty pissed off. He's crying. He goes to his room and he is pissed. He is ready to be a booter. So it's time, guys. He starts looking in the mirror, trying to make it, you know, fucking flinch and shit. And he fucking maybe leaves a mean comment on YouTube and then he hops on Black Ops 2. It is fucking going down, guys. So he sits down, he puts on his pair of turtle beaches and he looks something like this. And he finds his lobby. Now who is his prey? Let's just say his prey is a 12 year old kid named Jimmy. Now Jimmy's enjoying his time playing Black Ops 2 when Bobby joins and Bobby's crying. He's a little hysterical. He's making weird noises. Kind of sounds like the Joker. Jimmy's just like, hey dude, what's wrong? You sound upset. And Bobby's like, I'm gonna fucking suplex your goddamn router, faggot. Now, before booting little Jimmy offline, Bobby then has to let everyone in the lobby know that he is superior because he has a great power of making kids not play Xbox for 90 seconds. And then it happens, guys. Jimmy goes offline, and that's it. Jimmy's mother, on the other hand, was in the third season getting mindfucked by the show Lost, and it says Lost Connection. So she goes into Jimmy's room to see what's up, and she says, hey, Jimmy, you know, the internet went out. What happened? He just turns and gives her that little Samuel Jackson fucking tear down the eye like in the movie Glory. And she knows what's up. He goes, mom, we're under a DDoS attack. 
Jimmy's mother then gets that look in her eyes like a World War II soldier and then rounds up the kids and the husband and they go live in the mountains and grow their own food for the next 40 years. All because of that DDoS attack. And it's all Bobby's fault. So fuck you, Bobby. Now, of course, this entire story was made up 100%. I know a couple of you guys are like, seriously, dude, domestic violence? That's a joke to you? Dude, dude fuck, it's fucking Bobby, okay? Bobby deserves whatever Bobby gets. If, if Bobby's dad wants to pick him up like a Halo 5 assassination and kick him in his fucking face, he can do it. It's okay. It's Bobby. So through like six minutes of bullshit, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys did enjoy the video, drop a like, and I will catch you guys later. Later, tater. Oh, <laughs>